Hey guys, it's Aaron Heiser with Makers Leather Supply, and we are here at the Heart of Texas Leather Show with Miss Cheryl Reese, one of my favorite people in the world. Um, Cheryl and her husband Ralph run the Leather Crafters and Saddler's Journal uh, magazine, and they are the ones that put on this show, the Prescott Show, and the Sheridan Show every year. So that is three magical events put on this by this wonderful couple. And so Cheryl might say a few words for us, and then we're going to walk around all the booths. Thank you, Aaron. That was quite the introduction. We're excited to be here. This is our second show in Waco, Texas. We have uh, about 40 different vendors this year, and we've had about 60 workshops run on the first level. So it's been quite a week. This is day five for us, uh, if you count all the workshop days, but the show runs Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Um, today's Saturday, so it'll be open till five, and tomorrow nine until two on Sunday. If you do anything with leather at all, and you need supplies, this is the place to come. And we'd love to uh, entertain you with all of the vendors' uh, wares. So please come on down to the Waco Convention Center and see us. Alrighty. So, <laughs> there you go. Sorry about that, wrong button. So I'm gonna flip this around and we're gonna meet her husband, Ralph. Uh, come on, which one of these buttons does that? There it goes, all right. <laughs> There's Ralph right there. He Good is morning. running at their booth, which is the uh, the Leather Crafters Journal. So they've got all kinds of great patterns and stuff like that, pattern packs and uh, um, previous issues of their magazine. If anybody's looking for an older one, and things like that. So, what's your website? Leathercraftersjournal.com. Leathercraftersjournal.com. There you go. Um, that's where you can also find out about these shows and the classes that are going to be offered and all that stuff. So, all right, thank you, Ralph. Thank you. All right, just like in my previous show videos, here we have Vaughn Gators and Todd Hill Alligator Leather. Um, these guys are out of Florida, killing gators all the time. So, <laughs> um, these are the alligators that I use in my shop and my videos. Um, here very soon, I'm about to do a watch band video using some gator. It's gonna be a good time. So, if you're uh, interested in some alligator leather, there's their information right there. And so they're always helping you help. All right, moving right along. Right here we've got Double K Leather out of St. Louis, Missouri. Nobody cares about them, but we'll talk about them anyway. <laughs> so this is Brett right here. He comes to all the shows for, uh, for his family business here. There's their uh, contact uh, number and everything. Like I said, they're in the St. Louis area. They've got lots of great veg tan and tons of other leathers. I know they sell feeding products, um, tools, all kinds of great stuff. So give them a call if you're in their area and you need something. Or even if you're not in their area and you need something. Mr. Hockhauser walked off, but here's his awesomeness. Uh, he's always got tons of great leathers, lots of kid skins, lots of thinner stuff for people that are uh, making finer leather goods and stuff like that. Absolutely love his selection. He's always got great stuff, great colors. Hawk, how can they find your stuff? Phone number, website, what do you got? The website, ghleather.com. All right, so his website is ghleather.com if you're looking for anything special. He'll have it for you, guaranteed. Thanks, bud. And as always, here's the man that takes all of our money, Mr. Barry King himself, and his jewelry store of beautiful, beautiful, beautiful things. So uh, while the rest of us go broke, Barry King buys a new truck or something, I don't know. <laughs> so anyway, um, King Tools and Machine is what you would look up to find his tools online. Um, he does have a lot of retailers, such as that guy at Maker's Leather Supply and stuff like that, but um, I never can get actual video of his booth because we're open so <laughs> my old partner in crime mr clay miller here selling his wares at the the waco show this is also kind of his hometown show because he's just right down the road um clay makes some great stamps he makes lots of great hand tools and malls and things like that constantly adding to his wares and his uh his offerings um i know he has an etsy shop right and a website. What's the website, Clay? Miller Custom Leather Tool Company dot com. Um, he started making lots of wooden forms and stuff, which are always really cool for making um, bowls and uh, like here's a one for a pair of pliers uh, case and stuff like that. These are awesome things to have for people that are making uh, 
you know, stuff to sell and things like that. So yeah, Miller Custom Tools right there in Temple, Texas. How you doing, sir? I'm gonna pause this. All right, sorry about that. We had a few folks wanted to come up and say hi, and so we never stopped that. Um, so this booth is currently unmanned. Bork and Sons Cinches. Um, so they've got lots of uh, cinches and things like that. Um, they do have some brochures and contact information here. So if you're into saddle making, they've got lots of that. And then they've got lots of the, uh, I think they're called riggings. I'm, I'm not a saddle maker, folks. I'm sorry. Um, lots of very, very nice looking riggings and, and saddle horn stuff things like that so if you're into saddle making there is their contact information right there BorkSaddleryHardware.com right next to them we're not going to interrupt the man because he's busy but there's Mr. Dwayne Watts with his very very nice swiveling blade swivel knife um, refer back to our videos from Sheridan if you want more details on those but uh, what's the name of your your Etsy store again Dwayne DW Leatherworks on Etsy is how you can find one, some of his tools. He makes a really nice, uh, really nice lollipop burnisher, and uh, he's got several other new things out there this time. So give him, give him a look. All right, here we have Corwell Leather. Looks like American Alligator at its finest, right? Um, any of the YouTube followers out there might recognize this bag right here. That's the one made by Don, right, for his wife. All right. So if, if this is Don's trusted alligator guy, then he's probably got some good stuff. I mean, we all know how that works. <laughs> um, you got a website or? All right, so there's his contact information right there, CorvilleLeather.com. And there's some O's and U's in there. It can get confusing, so make sure you're looking at the screen and not just listening to me try to read it. And I'm keeping this card. <laughs> So he's got great colors and uh, and styles. Um, I may have to may have to try one or two of them out. Thank you. All right. I don't know that I've seen these folks before, but this is Leather Master Sewing Machines. Um, they got a two one four phone number. Is that Dallas? I'm sorry to interrupt, but in, up in Dallas. Okay. So Texans, that might be a great resource for us. Um, I'll, I'll get us some more information. Do you have a website by chance? I'm, one more time? Eric's. Eric's. Okay, so Eric's Sewing Machine Company .com. Looks like he's got some different leather stitchers here. Um, you might be worth uh, taking a look and uh, and getting on there and taking a look. Thank you, sir. Then here is Mr. Jesse Smith selling his uh, his uh, pattern packs and howdy doing howdy dootying all the folks. So one of his most favored ones is the Northwest Leather Carving book it's uh it's got he's got a really unique style and um jesse's been teaching for a lot of years and a lot of people owe their uh their leather livelihood to this man so definitely worth taking a look at his stuff oh yeah sorry we got to introduce katie back here so there's katie she comes to all the shows with jesse and make sure he doesn't uh get in trouble while he's there so yeah so there's jesse's uh contact information right there you got a phone number and an email jesse smith saddle at gmail.com if you're interested in his pattern packs and stuff they are definitely worth it Thank thanks you. jesse have a great day you bet all right sorry about that we had another pause there um so now i'm in the gomp hackbarth uh tool booth okay um one of the oldest names and leather tools as far as you know people that are still doing it um, anyway, he makes some very, very unique stamps, very high quality, very well made, very crisp impressions. Um, absolutely, absolutely great tools. Uh, if you're curious about their con uh, contact information, uh, he said, honestly, the best way to get a hold of them is the phone number. Let me get it where I can actually see that better. Phone number 520-642-3891. So give Lonnie Hyde a call and uh, he can get you taken care of. All right, here we have the Trey Hyde Company. Lots of uh, hair ons and uh, looks like kid skins and all kinds of goodies. Um, I know I've seen what buffalo. Bison. That's a yeah bison and stuff like that in their booths before. Uh, several pre-made things as well as um, just lots of great exotics and and, and hair ons. Um, to get a hold of them, looks like TreyHyde.com. T R A H I D E dot com. Take a look at their wares and see what you think. Thank you for the shout out. Thank you, sir.
All right, here's one of my favorites, Miss Lisa Sorrell. When I can't find something or have a really, really dumb question that I don't want to be made fun of for asking, I call Lisa. See, that's why I call her right there. Um, so I'm going to be doing a video here in a few days on uh, making the shoe kits. And um, one of the products I'm going to use is a jerk needle. One of the things that Lisa suggested to me. And uh, if you need one, you can get them at her, her uh, website. Um, so there it is right there, sorrel.shop. All right, I always just Google Lisa Sorrell, it comes up. <laughs> so anyway, um, Lisa's here, she's uh, teaching classes and uh, selling uh, mostly boot and shoemaking supplies, but uh, always very high quality stuff coming out of her shop. Thanks, guys. All right, we all know the Phoebing guy. So there's Ian from Phoebing um, right there. They've uh, been having a, a booth at the shows here lately and showing off all their uh, all their different products you know a lot of the time companies like mine will bring some of their products to shows but we don't carry them all so it's a good idea for them to come by and show everybody that hey we've got more than just what's being carried by a few of the retailers so you can always get onto uh, what's y'all's website feebing.com just feebing.com and that's f-i-e-b-i-n-g i always do f-e-i and never can find it so <laughs> anyway get on feebing.com and you'll see a lot more than what you knew that they made take a picture mark yeah, sure. I got a lot of your products. All right. I need some gun swings, though. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to pause this right quick and take a picture with somebody. All right. So this is the Spray Gunner booth, uh, specializing in um, airbrushes and airbrushing equipment, things like that. Uh, they've been coming to shows here recently. Sorry about that, guys. I've uh, been coming to shows here recently and uh, teaching classes and um, selling uh, airbrush stuff. So telling lies um, spraygunner.com is their website if you want to look at their wares so this is John Sudbury here he teaches all the classes and stuff at the leather shows and I've heard nothing but great things about all his classes very thorough instruction <laughs> all righty here we have K&T repair they are in the Dallas area is that right yes in the Dallas area they sell heavy-duty machinery and stuff last year at Wichita Falls I bought a massive clicker from these guys and I love it uh, once I finally got the dead gun thing moved into position at my shop <laughs> so anyway K&T repair um, there's their phone number right there 817-779-0072 um, see that's that's my clicker right there got that one and uh, it's amazing 27 tons of pressure big old huge clicking surface it is awesome so, if you need any uh, hard-to-find machinery or anything like that, these guys are right there in the in the central to northern Texas area, and they can help you out. All right, this is the other gentleman that takes all my money, Mr. Scott Davidson of Solid Rock Knives, makes some absolutely amazing leather cutting tools. And when I say leather cutting tools, here you can see that he has lots of great stuff. Okay, but then he's got what I call the back table. And it's got hunting knives and all the other pretty expensive things that I shouldn't buy, but I usually do. Anyway, his knives are absolutely top-notch, folks. You can find them on Facebook. Um, email at solidrockknives at gmail.com. Cell phone number, work phone number, it's all right there for you. Um, call Scott Davidson because, seriously, you will not be disappointed in a blade from him. And he's Thank pretty, you. too. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. All right, Montana Leather Company came all the way down to Texas to join us this year, and uh, we really appreciate that. I have heard nothing but great things about Montana Leather Company. Um, I've, I've met the folks that work their booth a couple of times, and they've been nothing but nice to me. And uh, anyway, I know they sell Herman Oak leather. They've got tons of odd lot stuff laying out here. Um, they've got master's glue that's getting harder to find nowadays so contact cement and stuff like that as well as barge right over here um anyway they're a great uh leather company they are up in montana obviously and uh so if you're up in their area or you just need stuff that's a great place to look um what's y'all's website montanaleather.com Montana as easy as it gets right there all right so walking on down we've got weaver leather everybody knows who weaver is they're not hard to find um, pretty much anything you could ever want or need in your shop. Weaver Leather's got it. So, um, yeah. Uh, that's all I have to say about that. 
Uh, Weaver's really good folks. Um, it's a really, really great company. They have very high quality, I mean, everything from hardware to their own brands of tools and things like that. Um, they do sell Maker's Leather Supply templates, so they got to be good people, right? So there you go. All right. Next up to bat, we've got the lovely Miss Rosa over here at Leather Wrangler's um, Leather Wrangler's booth, making the really nice blades and swivel knives and things like that. Rosa's always happy to show people what they've got going on, and of course, she looks so pretty doing it. So, um, anyway, they're out of Albuquerque, New Mexico. Phone number five zero five two six nine eight five six three, and what's your website? Leatherwranglers.com. They make it easy. So there you go. If you want a really, really good swivel knife or any other kind of blade, give them a ring. They've got them. Thanks, Rosa. My favorite booth in the whole show, Maker's Leather Supply, right here. Got the girls holding it down back here, and uh, Mr. Colton Stone helping us out a little bit. We really appreciate him helping sling leather this weekend. Not to mention, look at this hottie. Ooh, check that out. Dang, I hope I get to take her home. So anyway... <laughs> There's Miss Janie Sue right there. So, y'all already know what I got if you watch my channel, so we're just gonna kinda walk on by this booth. All right, over here is everybody's favorite hero. <laughs> the man himself, Mr. Don Gonzalez. He's busy, of course. Everybody wants to talk to Don, so we don't interrupt him. His lovely wife, Miss Claudia, over here. She is the one that actually does all the leather work in his shop. He's just the face on the camera because he's so pretty. But uh, anyway, they're here with, uh, with lots of advice, lots of talking. They've got uh, some really cool t-shirts and hats and stuff. His material pattern packs and uh, pretty much anything Don Gonzalez that you ever needed is going to be right here in this booth. How's it going? Thanks for all the information on your channel. Thank you. All right, over here we have Clinda Custom Saddles. Uh, Bob Clinda gives a lot of great classes at uh, these shows. Um, here's some of the, the shop work he's done. Um, his tooling is amazing. His construction's amazing. I mean, he's been doing this a long time, and he is one of the masters for sure. So uh, Bob does teach a lot at these shows, so his lovely daughter normally runs his booth for him. How are you today? Um, if you want to get a hold of them, clindasaddlery.com is uh, one of the easiest ways and uh, Bob or Clinda Saddlery, Clinda dot Saddlery at gmail.com um, if you want to order any of their pattern packs or anything like that they have lots of tapaderos, chaps, chinks um, spur straps uh, yeah um, and then there's the man himself there's Mr. Bob Clinda just one of the nicest guys you'll ever meet <laughs> you're kind of puffing it up <laughs> well I mean I got to it's you two <laughs> <laughs> Y'all have a great day. All right. Um, it's a really, really cool camera. I'll show it to you in a minute. Uh, so over here we've got uh, Jeremiah Watts products. This is his lovely wife right here. Um, selling all of his horseshoe brand tools and uh, their, their hardware and stuff like that. They've got amazing hardware. Ranch to the number two, arena.com is their website they have got some really great designs for hardware and stuff like that very high quality made um, i know that they are extremely picky about the materials and everything else that go into their tools and to their uh, um, products that are that are made for them so absolutely amazing stuff by uh, by the um, jeremiah watt and his family's company here lots of videos all kinds of great stuff All right, over here we've got Mr. Tim Purdy with SteelStamps.com. When people ask me where I got my big old huge gorilla stamp that everybody likes that I put on my stuff, this guy not only made it, he designed it. I sent him a design that just was not going to work at all, and he sent that back and said, how about this? And it's amazing, and I absolutely love it. So SteelStampsInc.com is where you want to go to get you a really, really, really nice maker's mark. And this is the kind of stuff we're looking at. It's these big old honking steel stamps right here like that's a flower cut out to uh to aid in tooling and stuff like that um he's got some ready-made stamps that are you know made in america and stuff like that uh here's some more examples of some of his maker's marks right over here and um 
it's one of those, I hate to sound all cliche, but it's one of those, if, if, if you can dream it, he can do it kind of thing. All right. Next to him, we've got the Kelly Leather Company. Mr. Kelly uh, is on the just on the outside of Waco. He sells lots of exotics, alligator, ostrich, elephant, things like that. He's got some great hides here, but he also does boots. If you come to his shop, you can basically custom design your own pair of boots out of dang near any leather you can imagine. Like there's some snapping turtle right there. Um, yeah. So yeah, this is Kelly Leather Company in uh, the Waco area here in Texas. Uh, his phone number is 254-855-7225. All right, over here we've got the Leather Machine Company. There's David, one of my bestest, bestest buddies right there. He's the, uh, the man behind the company most of the time. Um, so they sell the Cobra line of machines, of course, the same ones, I, they, they are the ones that I sell their machines in my shop. If I'm using a sewing machine in one of my videos, it came from them because I wholeheartedly believe in their product, their customer service, and everything that they do. So now we're walking along, not to mention all the pretty colors of thread. All right, here we have Dr. Glue. Good morning. Good morning, Dr. Rania. How are you today? Uh, doing fine. Yeah. Not, not too much to complain about. Right on. So here we have the Rania Glue, which is the uh, the um, water-based contact adhesives, uh, rubber cement type stuff. Um, the, he's got a new putty filler type stuff for uh, 3D embossing and, um, and things like that. Uh, website? You got a website? Oh, uh, sure. Yep. Okay. Where's his card? All right. For more information on his stuff, rainia.com, R-E-N-I-A.com. And uh, you can find lots of information on their adhesives and stuff. They're really, really great products. And um, he has made one hell of a name for himself in the industry. Thank you, sir. All right. Over here is one of the coolest dudes I've ever met. This is... <laughs> How you doing, Bobby? This is Mr. Bob Park right here. He does some of the most amazing work you've ever seen. He's got some great literature on um, some of the floral designs that he does and things like that. His, uh, his Edge Magic is an amazing, amazing product. Um, really great for slicking edges and stuff like that. And I always love his booth because, of course, his work is museum quality. And, I mean, there it is, just sitting there for you to get to see. Great stuff from Bob Park. Let's see if we can find his card there it is Bob Park custom leather designs I know he still does you know leather work for folks if you uh, if you ever need anything like that hidepounder at gmail.com there's his phone number and Bob is always willing to help out too so if you have some crazy question I bet he'll help you answer it thank you Aaron thanks Bob <laughs> All right, here's other people that take all my damn money. So, so this is Todd and Robert from Herman Oak Leather. Um, they always come to these and show, you know, all the great stuff that Herman Oak Leather can do for you. Um, yeah, Todd's what, sales manager? Yes, Todd is the sales manager at the plant. He does a decent tour of the plant. I mean, if you're ever there and you need one, he, he seems to know where most things are. The break room, the restroom, stuff like that. So, <laughs> anyway, and then uh, with him is Robert, um, who is a representative for Herman Oak, but he also owns um, Lewis Leather down in Bryan, Texas, College Station, that place. Um, sells to a lot of saddle makers, a lot of a lot of resale or re wholesale type uh, sell sales for the most part, but some retail as well. Um, you got a? Do y'all have a website? What's y'all's website? There it is. LewisLeatherSales.com. LewisLeatherSales.com. Um, Makers Leather Supply also represents him a little bit. So, you know, I mean, I got some of his stuff. So, anyway. All right, guys, thanks. All right, over here we got Gulliger Leather Company. Okay, Gulliger Leather is in uh, California, right? Yeah, silly Californians. <laughs> Actually, but you're Hawaiian, so. That's <laughs> oxy, right? Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, um, we got we got Carlos from uh, Gallagher Leather here. They uh, they make a lot of really great templates for saddle making and stuff like that. Um, you know, I make a lot of templates, but I don't know anything about saddles, so I just leave this stuff alone. 
Um, anyway, so Gulliger Leather, where is y'all's website? There it is. GulligerLeather.com. G-O-L-I-G-E-R Leather.com. Oop, no. Dot U-S. Sorry about that. You can see it, even if I am reading it wrong. <laughs> All right, so give them, a, give them a call if you're looking for anything. I know they sell Herman Oak Leather and uh, tons of other really high-quality stuff. We've only missed a couple of booths here. We're going to go over here and catch a couple more. Now, this is the Jim Shipley collection of leather. He's uh, been collecting leather art for years, but it's going to be its own video here in a few minutes. I'm not just going to pan on by this one because there's some amazing stuff sitting over here. Hey, how are you today? Good. So here we have the tooling bench. Um, they are from Cedar, Cedar City, Utah. I know we've introduced them in some of these videos before, but they uh, they take a lot of really nice old tools and make them into nicer old tools and hone them up, sharpen them up, and get them back on the market for uh, future leather crafters to have good, high quality tools. So, do you all have a website or a phone number that? Okay, it's not on that sign. <laughs> Four three five. 586-9591. So if you're looking for a hard to find or antique tool or something like that, I bet they've got it. Give them a ring. Thank you. Here with his hands full and his eyes in the microphone is, uh, or a mag magnifier, is uh, Mr. Jeremiah Watt himself doing a uh, demonstration on engraving. Um, it's kind of hard to see with the bright light in his hands, but there's the TV screen that shows what he's doing right here in front of everybody. I'm not going to try to break his concentration, but he puts on one heck of a demonstration. <laughs> so anyway, but he's in the GRS engraving booth. Um, I tried my hand at engraving. I went to the GRS school even and took a uh, class from a wonderful woman named Diane, but turns out I am a leather worker and not an engraver. So, um, GRS Tools, they're up in Kansas, and they are all American-made amazing tools. Over here with this crowd of folks is uh, Martin's Mix. Okay, so anybody that's, uh, that's met Justin Martin knows, uh, knows about his product, but he's got an amazing burnishing solution that works really, really well on just all kinds of leathers. Him and his wife are just the nicest folks you could ever meet, and uh, yeah, they do great stuff. So, Martin's Mix, y'all got a website? Yes. Yes. Martin's Mix 2020. So, Martin's Mix 2020. Oh, wait, no. No? Oh, wait. What is it again? Martin'sMix.com. So just like in my shop, if you want to know what's really going on, ask <laughs> Janie Sue. Funny. So here we ask Jennifer. So, all right, from now on we know on future videos, ask Jennifer. <laughs> Y'all have a great day, guys. All right. I think we about cut it all. Oh, no. The Orion Calf guys. All right, here we have Mr. Greg Carmack, and uh, he uh, he always brings the Orion calf stuff, so he's got some great calf leathers and things like this. I bought some from him a couple of shows ago, and I've made a few small projects out of it, and it's great leather. But what I'm most excited about is their dyes. They've got some really, really amazing dyes that apparently do stuff that the other dyes can't, which, I mean, I say apparently, uh, the proof is in the pudding right there, folks. But uh, anyway, I, I told him I'm gonna I'm gonna grab up a few bottles of this dye because I want to play with it and maybe see if I can help uh, help figure out how to use it because um, as he said the the woman that that designs this type of stuff for him is working on with this stuff three hours a day and she's just scratching the surface of its capabilities and what it can do so OrionCalf.com and uh, they have twelve different colors of dye and I'm gonna go home with one bottle of each dadgum one of them because I want to play with it so. Thanks, Greg. All right. I think I got everybody, and I'm tired of talking. <laughs> so, uh, again, I'm Aaron Heiser, Maker's Leather Supply. This is the Heart of Texas Leather Show in Waco, Texas at the Convention Center. I'm going to try to get this video out today so that maybe people that are in the area that watch uh, that maybe don't know about it can come on by. Thanks. Have a great day.